How's it going, boys? We're back. And before we get started, subscribe, like, share. Definitely subscribe. Definitely like. Definitely share. Like I tell you guys, I'm going to keep on telling you guys. I talk about a lot of cool shit. So, you know, how we run numbers up. And today, we're going back to the basement. Back in Florida with the good old gremlin himself, Rudy. Um, as you guys know, I opened up half a Commander Legends box last weekend for my Magic Weekend uh, video. I'm going to open up the other half today. Um, it is a 24-pack uh, booster box. And I opened up 12 the other day. I'm going to do another 12 today. I did get the tutor um, in that in that opening but we're looking for the lotus or honestly anything else pretty spicy out of the whole first half the only thing spicy we got was a tutor um everything else was like two dollar mythic and one dollar mythic hopefully we can you know we can get um you know something something spicy here in the in the second half uh let me zoom in real quick boys if you guys don't mind a little zoom and then let me pull out the man himself um i would do it on the on the po on the pokey broski uh, play mat i'm trying to update updating updated to eddie broski um but um uh, it's only fitting that i do it on an alpha investment what's called play mat aka a shirt um uh, this is from the shirt that he released this year money machine go burr which um you know it's only fitting especially as good as this set was because i'm pretty sure the whole reason why he this you know money machine go burr was because of, you know, Modern Horizons and just how crazy, you know, return on investment that is. Um, depending on the time, I might open that one up here in a minute. Either way, uh, let's get to this Commander Legends real quick. Um, like I told you guys in the last video, I mean, last video, um, I'm definitely looking for um, a Jeweled Lotus. I think I called it a Black Lotus in the last video. Nobody mentioned it. Nobody said anything wrong about it. But I'm pretty sure someone was like, look at this clown, thinking that there's a Black Lotus in the set. Um, no, I, I, I do know. I do know it's not. I just, you know, I don't know how to talk and I don't know how to read sometimes. So, yeah, I'll be making, messing up my words. But let's see. I'm going to try to do my stacks kind of how Rudy does it. Put all the bangers up here, the regular stuff over here. Um, a whole bunch of comments. Um, I did go through them a little slower last time. Um, but today, you know, we're going straight to the meat. Straight to the meat. Let's see. Cast down. Three visits. That's pretty nice. I've seen, like, uh, Rudy go nuts over, like, the full art. Um, version of it the border borderless version of it which uh i'm not gonna lie looks pretty cool because this art is already pretty decent i can only imagine how how nicer it gets you know as a, as a full art and let's see our first rare of the day is a uh, rakisha Rak rakisha devasser bam i'll put the price down there if it's you know has any any decent value like i told you guys um in the last video or my, my magic videos in general if it's over three dollars in value i do put a price if it isn't, I don't. So if this cost costs more than $3, you're going to hear a little ding. But uh, if you didn't, it probably didn't. But put the first rear right there. Going back to Uncommon Kraken. Shout out Kraken. Uncommon Kraken. Uh, son, son of something. <laughs> Look, it looks like Rudy. <laughs> and then our first foil is a common. Looks pretty cool. Strategic, strategic planning. Pretty dope. And then token card. All right, put that token card over here. Something major. All right, so definitely nothing spicy out of that first pack. Um, but let's see if we can, you know, change it up. Like I said, normally I've seen Rudy open up a box and get two of the spicy hits. You know, uh, the Tutor, the Mana Drain, or the Lotus in a box. Um, I'm not saying that's kind of like I, what I expect. But it would be nice if I get like the same quote-unquote ratios. All right, get all these commas out of the way. Straight to the meat. All right, and then bam phenom blade pretty nice oracle Psh. second rare of the, of the night magus of order human wizard nice put like i said i'll put a price up if it's anything crazy captain wraith put that right here to the side because that's a common a second rare in the pack meddler and a common hollow nice another token All right so, so far, two packs, three rares. Pretty decent. Pretty decent. Um, I, we still haven't got a, ma a method for tonight. Hopefully, we can get that out of this one. Because as far as I've seen, too, like, all the prices, most of the prices are in the mythics. So, we'll see, you know, if we can get something out of that. Hey. Ambush Viper. Pretty cool. It's just a common, but the art was cool. Um, I like the art. Even though, even on all, all, the, all the commons, it has pretty decent art. Uh, last last video I did go a little bit slower, but this one, like I said, I'm going straight to the meat. All right, Supreme Wheel, Stiffer, Merchant Raiders, 
Hey, tomorrow, Melodic Deluge. I know what's it called. He was opening a month. Which one was it? He kept on getting the full art, um, borderless version of this one. And uh, he was kind of like, oh, $2. Um, I don't know how much this one costs. It is a first Mythic of the Night. I'll put the price right here. If it's over $3, you know, you'll, you'll see, you'll hear the dink. If you, if it wasn't, you um, know, it's not over $3. But first Mythic of the Night, I'll put that boy to the side. Back to Uncommon. Hey, looks like MGK. <laughs> And then back to another common. Hey, a pirate monkey. Not the one from Modern Horizons that we're looking for, but still pirate monkey. And then hollow uncommon. Nice. All right. Put that over there. Elf warrior. Little token card. I've seen that one before. I see most of them, but I haven't seen that one before. That's pretty cool. All right. Same thing. Going through all the comments. I wish I knew how to count so I can just go through them by like counting them out, but I have to keep on looking at the, at the sign. All right, let's see. Thirst for Knowledge, Virtual. Hey, that's pretty cool. Patron of a Valiant. That's pretty cool. It's an uncommon, but I mean, decent art. And then, bam, rare, wrong turn. <laughs> all right, it is a funny card. I, I, I hear Rudy laughing all the time every time he pulls this, but it is a funny looking card. First rare of the pack, to an uncommon. Back to another uncommon. Celebrate a bounty. Okay. And then a hey, pretty nice looking hollow. It's just a common, but a hey, pretty nice looking hollow. Elf Warrior back to back. I literally said I've never seen it before. And then I get two back to back. It's pretty cool. All right. Let's see if we get one more mythic in this one right here. Man, I'm weak as hell. Or maybe this one just got stronger. Friday Night Magic. Oh, no. It's actually Saturday Night Magic for me. <laughs> I might post it today, um, depending on how fast I can edit it. Um, let's see. Oh, all right, cool. All right, so to the uncommons, I'm not going to lie. I thought I see, I think I see something flashy back there, but I'm not sure. All right, Shredder as an uncommon. Hey, Hunter's Insight with a Jaguar. Nice. And then Meter Golem, pretty decent. First rare of the night, Promise of Tomorrow. Um, that, I'm not going to lie, it looks a little spicy. It looks a little uh, expensive. I'm not sure off the top of my head. If it is, you're here, Dean. First rare of the pack. Second, uh, what's it called? Back to an uncommon. And then second rare of the pack. Nice. Old Sworn Centau. Second rare of the pack. And then, yo. Yo. <laughs> I knew it was something spicy. But God, this this is beautiful. Vampire Tutor as a revert. As a, as a, what's it called? Reverse. As a hollow mythic. This for sure has a nice ticket. The non hollow is like 40 bucks. This has to be 60. I'll put the price up right here, but yo, yo, that's 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 a good hit. That's a good hit. If you guys don't mind, I'm gonna have to have to sleeve this one straight off the back. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Alright, alright, alright. To be honest, I think with that one and the non hollow that paid for the whole box. So anything else out of this. It's probably free tendies. So let's see what we can get. Who doesn't like free tendies? And I'm greedy, so let's try to get a Lotus. <laughs> and plus, I haven't I haven't seen the Lotus. So let's try to get that. All right. So Nightblade, Sunset Pyramid. Hey, Sakamiya's Will. All right. So Sakamiya's Will. I think this one has a decent value to it, too. Yeah, I'll put the price right here. Because I think it does. I'm not sure. First rare of the pack. Hey. Second. We're going back to Uncommon. But that looks really, really dope. Ward Wing Familiar. Put that to the side. Hey. Another Angel. Second Mythic. Well, third Mythic. Considering that that was a Mythic too. Uh, third Mythic of the of the what's it called. Of the Night. And back to a Common Hollow. All right. Hitting a, a Common Hollow after you just hit a Mythic Hollow. It just, it's not the same. It's not the same, but I love that. I love that. Um, if you guys didn't see my first episode, too, um, I already pulled my etched, etched card out of that, out of that um, what's it called, out of this box. I'm kind of hoping I get another one. I'm not going by. Um, hey, another pirate monkey. Of course, not the one we're looking for. Uh, and let's see. As soon as we get to the uncommons, we can start. Hey, that looks pretty dope. It's just a common, but, it's, you know, it looks pretty cool. All right. Engine. Hey, Richies, Riches, two goblins. Me and Rudy looking for money. <laughs> hey, this dragon looks pretty clean. It is just uncommon though, but it looks pretty clean. Hey, first rare of the of the pack. 
Acroma's Will. Did I already get that? Nope, I didn't. But Acroma's Will. And then back to Uncommon. Hey, that looks dope. That looks dope. Pretty creepy, but it looks dope. And then back to another Uncommon. All right, and let's see if we can get something. Nope, just another Common Hollow. All right, we're down to the last five packs. But so far, like I said, this is all free money. Free tennis right here. Whatever we pull out of this, it's absolutely free tennis just because both of those Vampiric tutors have paid for the box. Especially, I ended up getting these for like 105. So, you know, I think it was like 105 shipped. So, pretty, pretty decent deal. Honestly, if you guys can pick it up for like $100 just for a seal collection type shit, definitely, definitely keep, pick it up. And as you can see right now, just, I mean, two pulls, they pay for the box. So, I don't know. I, I don't I think so. You know, you don't lose in this one. But signs, hey, Reviant. That monster's about to eat that rabbit. Bless his heart. And then first rare of the pack, Blasphemous Act. Blasphemous. Every time I think about Blasphemous, I think about Stephen A. Smith. Shout out Stephen A. Smith. What up, Unk? And then going back to Uncommon, Engineer, and Skywarn. Decent. And, hey, Meteorch Mace. Uncommon Hollow. Pretty cool. All right. Hopefully none of these have, like, you know, a decent price value. And I hopefully I, I gave myself enough time to put like the price check on it. Um, I know like in Pokemon, I 100% know you know what has a value to it. But every time I'm editing a Magic episode, and like I find like an uncommon that's worth like five dollars, I'm like damn. And sometimes I haven't done it recently, but I'll like speed right past through it, and I'm like, whoa, that was worth five dollars. Why didn't I stop? But Thought Vessel, nice. Another uncommon, perfect. Imperious, perfect. I don't know how to read. Also, you guys will probably learn. All right, let's see what the first, uh, what's it called, rare or mythic of the pack is. Hey, Harvest. Harvester? Nice. Nice shade Harvester. Back to Uncommon. Hey. Shadow Cat Familiar. <laughs> that looks cool. That looks cool. Keep that to the side. Hey, double double rare pack. I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm not going to lie. And Tor Hollow. Blade Brand. Just a common. All right. Down to the last three. Our hope and dreams of a lotus are coming down to these last three. Let's see if we can get it. All right. That looks like that's a pretty cool art. It's just a serpent, but it's just a common. I mean, let's see. Keep on going. Keep on going. There it is. All right, cool. Val Duty. Nice little uncommon. I don't know how to pronounce that, but it's an uncommon. A hey, Shimmer Mirror. <laughs> Dope. And then the first fear of the pack is a. Uh, Hey, recruiter. All I know is that one recruiter that's like, hey, and then that one has like a pretty decent premium. I don't know how much this one costs, but I'll put the price there if it's over $3. And then back to Uncommon. Jerry, Master of Review. <laughs> okay. And then, oh, Double Rare Pack. Nice. Neymar, Trickster. Pretty cool. And then back to Uncommon Hollow. Hey, Prismatic Piper. I, 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 I keep on I keep on pulling those. I really wonder what those are. Because I, I know I said it last time that Rudy just pulls those and he doesn't care. But I know he pulled like a full art version of it. Or like a textured version of it. And he was pretty excited off that. So I, I wish I didn't have played Magic. The dude's going. It looks pretty fun. I'm not going to lie. All right. All right. Scholar of the Stars. There's a first common. Speed run. Speed run. Speed run. All right. There we are. All right. Lightning Rig Crew. More Monkey Pirates. Pretty dope. Hey, Scholar, Sphinx, Humanoid, that's dope. <laughs> Alright, Strength of the Pack. Hey, a bunch of little dinosaurs, cool. First rare of the pack is a uh, Court of Ambition. Okay, pretty nice. Pretty nice. Um, I've seen Rudy go nuts over this, but then also they were older videos, so that might have been when it had some value. Either way, there's a price. First rare of the pack, back to Uncommon. Hey, nice rare, dude. Oof, little elf. And then, oh, psh. Mira. Thorn of the Blade. Shh. <laughs> and then just a regular common foil. All right, cool. All right, so now we're down to the last pack of the video. So as far overall, overall like I said, this, this is with us pulling the non-hollow and the hollow of the Vaparmic Tutor. Like everything else was free because that basically paid for like the whole box. But we're greedy as fuck and we want to get a Lotus. So let's see if we can pull one. All right. Speed running straight to the commons. Hey, nice. Varnish Heart. 
pretty dope. A little uncommon. Man, Intric Maze. We pulled that one hollow. All right. Pride of Protect is the last uncommon before, well, second last uncommon, or maybe third, before our first rare. Let's see. Bam. Sapphoric Eruption. Pretty dope. It is a mythic, so it was a four mythic opening today. Put that to the side. Back to uncommon, dead tide. And let's see if we can end it off with a rare. Nope. A Vandal Familiar. But pretty cool art. And I like wolves. And psh, playing old hollow. And <laughs> prismatic piper. But cool. Boys, overall, overall, like I said, pretty cool box. Pretty decent box. As far as like my first experience with a, uh, what's it called? A Legend Commander, Commander Legends box. It was pretty decent. I don't know the overall total of the Mythics that I got, but I must have got, I mean, if I got four right here, I must have got four. The other one, it must have been an eight Mythic box and plus a Mythic, oh, what's it called? Mythic Rare. That's pretty dope. I think this was the time whenever you only got one either Rare Mythic or, I mean, one Rare or one Mythic in a Hollow. So for that one to be my, you know, my pool, I'm pretty happy with that. But to end the night off for Magic Weekend, I am going to open up this Modern Horizons 2 um, set pack. Um, I'm a big fan of Modern Horizons. If you guys don't know, that's going to be like my nostalgia 10 years from now whenever I um, whenever I revisit Magic or whatever happens. Um, right now, I definitely do have the Magic bug. I quite do enjoy just opening up Magic cards. So, yeah. So, I might have nostalgia eventually. But, all right. Not a signature card, as you guys know. I have, still haven't gotten a signature card out of Modern Horizons, but it's it's open, it's open. All right, mountains. All right, Revenu. I don't even know how to pronounce that. All right, Vanish Claw, Reaver, a Tosser, <laughs> Terminal Agony. Okay, and then a Bridge. Common. All right, Sorrows. First first rare of the pack is a. In normal high art. Pretty decent. I don't think it's that expensive, but pretty decent. First red pack on over here. Alright, bone shredder as an uncommon. Hey, this is a what's it called? Classic water, or you know, or I forgot what it's called, but yeah. Vow something. I don't know how pretty I don't know how to read that, but that looks clean. And like, you know, the old border style. And then hey, it is a mythic. Garth one eye mythic with the old border. That's pretty dope. Um, definitely not the definitely not the monkey or um, a land. So or fetch land. So not what we're looking for, but it is a mythic hollow with the old border. So that's pretty dope. Put that to the side and psh, just a token. Alrighty, boys. Those were the hits for tonight. Like I said, if it, these any of these had any crazy value, you would have seen like the little bean and everything. Overall, super happy I pulled this. Um, I might end up selling this one and the other one as like a set um, for a decent deal. So if you guys are interested, hit my Instagram. Um, bro, Eddie Broski at Instagram. Uh, hit me up for these two. Definitely um, probably get rid of them soon. Especially right now that they have like a decent value. But overall, boys, um, comment. Thank you guys for watching. We out.